They certainly are, although I have to say that the end result isn't quite as scary as the process of actually making them. Okay, so... Okay, who is this? And who's this? And who is this? Cray. Right, well, while you ponder, the next one is... And this is our Oz. And systems recognising faces definitely fall into this category. These technologies are now being used in many applications, and it's well documented that they don't work as well for everyone. So I spoke to somebody who fell foul of one of these systems a couple of years ago when she was trying to get a new passport. How does this make you feel as somebody with dark skin where you possibly don't feel like this has been designed properly to cater for you? So it needs to get things right, right? Well, Craig Langren from the BBC radio programme People Fixing the World has been looking at how we can create facial recognition systems that work for everyone. Days that are visiting the building. You must inflate for... They're not the same. My job doesn't actually depend on this, does it? The process wasn't pressure free either. Oh, that was pretty intense. You really don't want to be interrupted by a child or a housemate. <laughs> <laughs> so let's see. Um, you're risk averse and you can hold a lot of information in your head. I have to say that is you. And come to think of it, that's me too. What a coincidence. We must both be in the right job then. Well, there you go. And long may it continue. Um, part of the job, of course, now involves saying goodbye. So could you offload all of that information that you've been holding in your head, please? Yes, as ever, you can find the team on social media on YouTube, Instagram, Facebook and Twitter at BBC Click. Thanks for watching and we'll see you soon. Bye bye.